Hi, this is Aaron. Today we have a new case for the iPod Nano from GUT, or I shouldn't say it's necessarily that new. However, um, it is for the last generation iPod Nano. It does not have the cutout for the new speed or the new video camera, which is good because I don't have that yet. So here is the case itself. This is actually an armband case, and as you can see, it's the armband strap is here. You've got your case with a plastic covering on the back. We've got kind of a nylon breathable material, and this is where you would put the iPod in, and your strap. So let's, let's go ahead and show you first how this fits in and how well it works, and we'll go from there. Now the confusing part to me on this particular case, I have not used this for any amount of time. However, the confusing part is you've got this one spot here, and it looks to be like it's for the, the, uh, the headphone jack. However, it's hard to get to, you want to be able to get to the hold switch as well. So we'll have to see how well that works. So we'll just, it's kind of a snug fit. See how well it goes in here. Okay, well it's in pretty well. Let's see how that looks. Now armbands, as you know, are more for working out, jogging, bicycle riding, anything like that. So you're not too concerned about seeing the screen other than when you're taking a look at it to uh, select your song or whatever you have playing. Now it does seem to hold this very snugly in here so I have no doubt saying that you know even if you were to jostle this thing short from slamming this on the ground you know from a fall or something I think it's going to be pretty well protected. Right here it's it's snug in here. It's not going to fall out. It's got this lip over the top. And I think I could get that to go down a little bit further. There we go. So I guess if you want to put it on hold, you fold this back, put it on hold, and you shut it. Not too big of a deal. And this does provide some extra protection from it falling out. You know, it's not coming out of there at all. It's in there pretty snugly. Now the controls on here, you can see the whole screen, which is nice. The controls on here do seem to, well again, I'm running into the same problem as some other cases, but actually this works pretty pretty good. Let's go music. So you'll be able to uh, get in here and actually, there we go. It is a little bit difficult, but again, your iPod's protected, and this is more of an arm strap thing, and I have seen this many times with this type of case, that they're just not as conductive as your finger is going to be across this different across the um, across the plastic membrane. So let's go ahead and take a look at the strap itself. We'll go ahead and open that. And so in the back here we have nylon material. This is breathable so I don't I, I'm imagining they do that to keep it uh, so it doesn't make you warm while you're jogging and it also probably keeps some of the sweat or something away from the iPod. This is a stretchable elastic material. You can see it's stretching and bending and when this folds over, simply goes through the strap, or through the loop here, and then we Velcro it down. So not a whole lot to the case, uh, but it is a strap for jogging. You know, put it on your probably most likely on your arm or even your wrist, I guess, if you wanted to, uh, and and it will work. Um, I would imagine that this might work better when you're sweaty, just as you have more conductivity between the saline sweat uh, coming out and this particular touch touch a uh, click wheel here so I don't see uh, a whole lot of disadvantages other than this is about the same as you see through any plastic barrier like this however the strap itself is pretty beefy built pretty well this plastic piece is very thick compared to another one I've seen and uh, that's that's pretty much it for this case it's from gut cases check them out. They also uh, make Pinder bags, which is like laptop bags and that sort of thing. Again, that's gut cases. This is the iPod Nano armband. This is Aaron. We'll see you next time.